Hey guys, in this video, I will show you how you can fix a uh, packet loss, high ping and lag spikes on Valorant. So without further ado, let's get started. First, I will show you easy ways and then I will show you hard ways. It will be a little bit harder, but just bear with me and I will show you every step that you need to do here in order to get a, uh, not to get high ping and packet loss and lag spikes. So without further ado, let's get started. First of all, open up browser. Then you need to just write server, Valorant server status and then uh, press on the first link here and open up this then select Valorant select your as you can see here your uh, uh, server continue and then look if there is no reports if there is no reports this means problem uh, is on your end on your internet connection uh, and not theirs if there is some problems uh, you you can't do nothing about it you just need to wait then what you need to do here is to go to fast.com and test your internet speed if you have good internet speed, you're good to go. And if you don't, maybe lim limit some devices and restart your router. Uh, then what you can do here, you, you can go to on search, write SIMD, right click on it, run as, uh, uh, run as admin, SIMD. And then you need to put a few commands. So first one is uh, IP config forward slash flash DNS. Another command is nash uh, winsock reset. And after that, restart your computer. Then what you need to do here is to go to uh, settings. On settings, you need to go to a, a network and internet, advanced network settings, and reset your network. If you're using Wi-Fi, you need to put your password again. If you're using internet cable, don't worry, you don't need to do nothing. Close this, then go to a control panel. Control panel, uh, look for network and sharing center, small icons. Then look for change adapter settings find your internet connection, right click on it, properties, a internet protocol version four, use the following DNS server addresses and on preferred DNS server, write 8.8.8.8 and on alternate DNS server, 8.8.4.4 and apply the changes. Mm -hmm. uh, then what you need to do here is to go on Valorant here, uh, write client Valorant, press on this little thing here, go to settings and look for Valorant path. For me is eDrive Valorant live. So I just need to then open up a file explorer here, then press on this PC and then a volume E, Valorant, live, and I will find exe file. So you just need to copy the path and then you need to go to Windows Defender Firewall, Windows Defender Firewall, allow another app, change settings, allow another app, browse. And then paste the path here and then add it here. If you're getting error, like I do, this means uh, Valorant TXC already added, so you don't need to worry about it. So you hit cancel, but uh, do not close this window here because we will need this. Then what you need to do here is to go to virus and threat protection, then select a manage settings, then exclusions, press yes, add an exclusion folder. And then again, paste the folder here and then select live or Valorant and then just select folder. And then what we need to do next is to look for right client on search, right click on it, open file location, then uh, right click again, uh, open file location and then copy the path here and add the exclusion here, uh, paste it right client and select folder. Then go to Windows Defender Firewall, uh, allow another app, browse, paste the right client uh, and then put exe here. So I already added, so I don't need to do anything here. And then look if the problem persists. If the problem persists, then write run on search or press Windows and key. And then here you need to just write gp edit uh, dot m s c. Press OK. Then you need to look for Windows settings, click on Windows settings, then right click on policy based QoS and then select advanced Q QoS settings. Then select this, control D SCP marking requests for uh, applications and services, and then here press ignored and okay. Uh, then what you need to do here is to right click on policy, create new policy, write Valorant, here write 46, hit next. Select only applications with this executable name. And then you need to, again, look for Valorant TXE. 
So as you may know, you can go to right client and look for the path. But for me, is this path here. And I need to look what uh, is named. So as you can see here, uh, Valorant with capital uh, letters. So just copy the name and then put it here and write exe. Then press next. Uh, these options are good. Uh, press next and then here select TCP and UDP and apply the changes. And then restart your computer and look if the problem persists. And if the problem persists, I highly advise you to use exit lag. I will leave the link in the description below so you can uh, register through me and I get small commission for that. But don't worry, it has a free trial. You don't need to put any credit information. I use this if uh, when I did not have good internet, I use this uh, every time when I play the games. And what it does basically, it finds better uh, connection route and it eliminates packet loss, uh, lag spikes and uh, any of the network issues related things. Of course, not always, but uh, in my personal experience, in a lot of times I got in games better connection. So all you need to do here when you install client and register for a free trial without credit card information, uh, go to Valorant here, then select apply routes and then minimize this or it will be automatically minimized and play the game and your connection should be way, way better. So I leave the exit lag in the comments or in the video description so you can register to me. Just try it out. It will cost nothing. You don't need to put any of the credit information and you will get a free trial, I believe, for three or uh, seven days. So yeah, that's basically it. If I help you out, please press like and subscribe for more. Take care. Bye.